to the final part and the home stretch of the second round of the Open Championship. Uh, we're three shots in the lead, so we're, we're kind of cruising a little bit at the moment. Playing better than we did yesterday. Uh, yeah, what I was going to talk about was uh, the Masters. Uh, potentially, kind of hope uh, that they would update I really love the and man. bring the course Wise into the PGA Tour. Guy hits a shot hard Perhaps the Augusta the and the, the Par 3 course, says, which would have okay? been absolutely fantastic says, if they did it okay? just prior to the Masters there, one? which sometimes they do. Another it's a kind of showcase event. It's always good to sort of bring the course iron, out when the course iron, is on the telly. Creates a bit of interest. Uh, but sadly, there was no update. Daddy There's no course said, update. Uh, Augusta. I don't know if Augusta's ever going to come to PJ Tour. I think it will at some point, but uh, whether it's going to be, you know, sometime soon, I don't know. I, I really don't. Uh, probably just make this green. But it's disappointing that there was no release. Uh, next course update. I don't know when it's going to be. Is it going to be free? Or are they going to start charging? Uh, I mean, I still like this game. I still think it's a, it's a decent game. It's got its faults, but I think every game has. I don't think there's a a game out there that's, that's perfect. If there is such a thing, then, you know... It's always got some kind of fault. Um, but I really enjoy PJ Tour. I think it's graphical, it's nice. I think it plays decent. Uh, some courses are easier than others. Uh, some courses are actually quite tough when you play it on the hardest settings. When you play it on the, the you know the, the arcade settings with the blue art, it shows you where you're going. Then it's just a, to me, there's no point in playing it. Uh, there's not many games I play on the hardest level. As I say, I play this on the hardest. The only thing that I don't have is the green grid. I have it on, so if I put it off, that would be the, the hardest setting possible in this game. But as I said before, I don't see the point in doing that because you don't, you don't have any idea of depth perception and how the putt goes. You know, in, in real life, you can get down and look at a putt and go, okay, there's a wee hill there, there's a break there, but in this, in digital form, uh, unless they made it so that you could get down low and check round the green, but then that takes a lot more time to get the putt. So I find the grid system's good. It shows you where, where the slope is, but there's always a kind of a guesstimation in there where you know you've got a chance of missing. So I'm happy. I'm happy at the level this game's at for me. Uh, as I say, some courses are easier than others. This one is a point in case, basically. Oh, and well, <coughs> sometimes. Oh, <laughs> nice. I'm back onto the green, but it kind of bounced the wrong way. But I find out. I, I mean, yeah, there's a lot of folk gripe about this game. I've, I've said this before in previous videos, but I, I mean, I enjoy it. I think it's. I think it's a decent game. I'm not going to say it's a brilliant game. I think there are some minor issues. Uh, the clear mode is a bit, you know, it'd be nice to have more customization. It'd be nice to have more equipment getting updated. Uh, it would be nice to have like a, a tournament schedule that you can look at and see who's won previous events and stuff like that. Uh, the Tiger Woods 14. Oh, not enough. Tiger Woods 14 is still a great game. I mean, I'm, I haven't I played it about a month, two months ago. And it's actually quite. If you play this game and then go back to that, it's it, it is showing its age, but it's I mean it's still a great game to be honest. All of those courses. Uh, the only regret I have is not buying the. Uh, course park, there was a bit. 
I'm trying to think how many courses there were. There was, it was quite a big park. There might have been 15 courses or something, or even more. Yeah, and I, I had, had every course. But you can't even buy it now. It's not available anymore. Yeah. That's one we regret, because it's still a good golf game. As I say, the, the graphics are a bit... Oh, that's going to hit that road. That's out of bounds. Oh, that hit the road. Gone. You OB. twat. Third shot now after having gone OB. Okay, that's going to add a couple of strokes to my to my round. Yeah, but, you know, they just... There's just a couple of things that they could do with taking on board. Um, especially the career mode. I mean, it's okay in a way, but you know it could just be better without some. You know, just the way Tiger Woods 14 had it was was good. You, know, you could look at the tournaments coming up. You could look at the tournaments previous and see who won, so you could see who was on form and stuff. But you know, unless you write stuff down here, you don't really have any indication of who's won previous. That's why I like to record my videos because I can go back and say, oh, who won. Who won the US Open in Season 3, or Season 2, or who won this tournament back then? Okay, we're making a real meal of this hole. club face open just a bit at impact, and that one moves considerably to the right of the flag But, uh, yeah, Augusta was a disappointment. I think it would have been great for the game. I think, I think it would have made a lot, a lot of people really happy because... You know, it's such an iconic course. And the fact it was in the last couple of Tiger Woods just at the end there was was just fantastic. It was great to play it. Oh my goodness. My goodness, what does a guy have to do to we make could a could actually be getting back behind the leaders here. Uh, but I don't know if it'll ever be included. I really just I don't know. Does it breaks more than that? Five inches down as well. Here we go. Is this for double bogey? Wow, he got robbed. Broke a little bit more. No, it's like kissing your mother and Triple bogey, Just guys. To That's going to be back to six ball. under par. Out of bounds. Will be. You love to watch him disappear, don't you? Oh, seven. Oh, we were ten under. Oh, Frank, Kevin, so many huh? landmarks seven under par through the eight. So he's right. just starting his round. The bunker on the left. Here we go. And this is a fantastic hole. I love this hole. Road. Yeah, there's um, all those features. Is one of the reasons why no one would be allowed to design a hole like this today. Yeah, so, I mean, to miss the license for, for Augusta, it's probably one of the biggest mistakes EA's made in a, in a long time. I mean, that's something that should have been top priority, basically. You know, you, you have all the, the major championships in, all the courses, you know, it's, it's basically what the game should be, but there you go. That's life, as they say. Hope's going to take it over a little bit. The wind should bring it back. Not bad, not bad. We chip here. Yeah, so really a, a big mistake there. Yeah. So, question is will Augusta ever come to this version? I mean, they said that they're not going to bring out a new version this, this year. Uh, this game, they're just going to add to it, so, who knows, two foot up, yeah, let's go for it. Oh, so right I just went straight, straight at it. Standing over this putt, concentrating on the read. It's a part, seven under par, we remain. Frank, a solid par oh. right there. Has went to eight position. under. Frank, is there huh. a more famous landmark in the sport than the tiny Swoken Bridge? 
Well, we're not going to drive this uh, game with that one. Yeah, so I mean, you've got to question why they didn't get it in. There might have been other factors involved, I, I don't know. Uh, but it's, it, I mean, to me, everybody's losing out because it's. It, I think it'd be great in the game. I think graphically, it would just be fantastic to play Augusta with this level of detail. Uh, but you know, it's, it's one of these things. Are we ever going to see it in, in this version of the game? Or we're going to have to wait for a new version coming out, a new physical copy. I think it will come, whether it comes in an update later this year, uh, or whether it comes in a game, a new game coming out. Because I think they said that uh, they weren't going to release a new, a new version, they were just going to add to this game, which I think is a good thing, but because it means you can build up courses and you can have, instead of buying another game, then you've got to buy more courses to get, I mean, it's just, it's, it's quite annoying. That was huge right there, still with a great chance to come away with this title. There we go, the end of par we are, right, we'll see where we are in terms of overall leader, behind her. Tied or, or whatever. So let's see. Probably did a lot more talking in this video. Right, there we go. John Ha. Huh? Oh, it's, I thought it was Kevin. It's Kevin Nah, sorry. Right, so he's nine under par, so we're only one behind. So we're, we're on course. We're on track for the third major this year. We've uh, got a couple of minutes left. Yeah, so I mean. Uh, I don't. I don't know when EA is going to bring out a physical edition update. Uh, it will not be this year. They said that they they, they weren't going to release an uh, an update every year. So how long is this game going to be? Uh, I mean, as I say, I don't think there's much wrong with. It. I, I think they need to change like the career mode. They need. Augusta in the game, I think, to complete all the other, because I mean, they've actually just released uh, Oakmont, which is the uh, US Open, they've also got Troon, which is the Open this year, uh, I don't think they have the PGA course, so I mean, they've got courses that are hosting majors, but they don't have... Uh, Augusta, which, I mean, it just, it, I was really disappointed, I'd, I'd get my hopes up uh, just prior to the uh, the Masters, that they would release Augusta for it, but no, it didn't come about, so that was a, a major disappointment on, on behalf of PGA and EA Sports. Uh, it's just a shame, really. I think they're doing the f the the, because there's people that play this game, there's people that moan about it like twenty four seven. Uh, but the Facebook page EA Sports PJ Tour, I mean they don't update you, they don't really reply to any of your, yeah, any of your kind of messages. So it, it's it's disappointing, you know they. All EA Sports had to do was say, look guys, um, Augusta's not coming out before the Masters. It's in the pipeline, it's scheduled to come out, but it won't be for, you know, this quarter. It might be next quarter, it might be round about June, July. Is it coming out? Is it not? You know, just to be honest but with the, the customers, I mean, it's, it's a shame. Because uh, they don't really update you on certain stuff, which really kind of bugs my mints, to be honest. Uh, anyway, guys, that's going to con con conclude this video. Uh, probably the next third round and fourth round, I'm going to concentrate more on the, the golf and instead of yapping absolute rubbish for 15 minutes. So, 
Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button, uh, it'd be greatly appreciated. And I will see you for the third round, probably coming up next couple of days. So, thanks for watching, see you later. Bye.